Are you ready, adults? Because I don't want to appeal to children. That's freaking creepy. What's that? You are great. Who lives by himself and plays video games. Fruit and doggy. Who's a bachelor, doesn't have a girlfriend. Fruit and doggy. Who's going to stop there before he feels worse? Fruit and doggy. And that's it. Yay! And yeah. uh, Patrick wears four pairs of underwear too. Uh, I was about to say, with how off, how bad his hygiene is, that's probably not a good thing. But let's let's not dwell on that subject. This is a throw fruit. Patrick can th pick up throw fruit and throw it. Yes. B to pick it up and B to throw it. Destroy kit tiki's, damage robots, push buttons. Oh man, it goes back quickly, huh? I thought there was like a little. There we go. Kind of a simple aiming guy. Ooh, present everyone! I mean, it, it's kind of a present in and of itself, isn't it? I mean. And stomach bash! Oh man, you're getting some sonic waves from that. Patrick is pretty darn strong. Oh. Are you? Oh, jeez. I was wanting to, like, interact with the guy, but I guess that's not a thing. You can throw fruit up steps. Yeah, that's right. I remember those sections. Because he had a kind of... Too bad. That's right, you can catapult Patrick too. Patrick Teeter Totter! That only Patrick can use. Yep. In other words, Patrick Jump Good. Well, Patrick Throw Good? It feels a little bit more accurate. Heck, why not? You gotta carry a lot of stuff around. I mean, it's only the one fruit over and over and over again, Patrick. I don't think that counts as a lot. That counts as one. What does this do? Bus stop! You may switch between... Oh, there we go, that's what it does. I thought it was going to take me to another level. Nope, I'm just dumb. Okay, that's... I'm going to be doing that a lot, I think, because that's kind of entertaining. I'm easily amused. I'm an idiot. I'm not just playing a role as Patrick. I am being Patrick. And Patrick's... He looks almost kind of menacing with that smile. It just doesn't look quite right. Thunder Tiki! When Patrick touches it, it will begin to storm and after a few seconds we'll go BOOM! Don't be near when it goes boom. I mean, that's pretty good advice. That also happens when you're SpongeBob. And I presume, uh, Sandy, what's this? Oh! I didn't know he could pick those up and throw them. I'd forgotten that. Ow! That's not really what I was going for. Why that, won't that just take me back here? Yep. <laughs> Like I said, folks, I'm playing a stupid pink star. Because that's basically what I am. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. No. I was about to say, except when it comes to you, particle head, watch where you're going. Except when it comes to YouTube, then I'm definitely not a star. Ayo! What is talking to me? Almighty Rock, play a venture command! Patrick does have a thing for us. Down here, you big pink lummox! Oh, hi there, Mr. Blankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? I should. So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. Why is that? Script. I was in an undesirable position yesterday. The yellow necklace. 
Let's not go into detail there. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions and the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop making low-quality design and knock-off wallets. Why don't you just do that instead of trying to run a chum bucket? Oh, thank you! And do we do we really want SpongeBob to be cartoon to be using words like sweatshop? It's, considering all of the merchandise big shiny button! Considering all of the merchandise that exists to SpongeBob, clothing articles. Feels like a bit of like a professional courtesy that you wouldn't want to go down that area. This might oh yeah. This might not really work out for you. You don't want to draw attention to your own company's dirty laundry. Just a thought, you know. That was a thought. Remember, Patrick can throw it through fruit, and then pick it up and throw it again for wilts. Uh, yeah. I remember the thing you told me five minutes ago. Uh, I was expecting an Amy thing to show up. That was weird. Well, that works. I'm in spite. Ah, it does break it fast. Okay, that's good. No, not! Uh, dang it, Patrick! Wait, how do you even. What is a whistle? I didn't even need to throw it up those steps, did I? Dang it! Dang it! Jellyfish, get out of here. And again, it is called Jellyfish uh, Cave, so I guess they have more variety to be here than I do. This is true, it's not called Patrick Star Starfish Caves. So shiny. That's like really lethal. Why is that here? That's kind of funny. Just belly bash it. Ah, uh, here we go. This is more what I was expecting. Oh, jeez. Good throw, Patrick. Uh, it's like thinking... Good presents. Oh, I thought it had to go over there somewhere. Nope! Overcomplicated. Again. Thank you for the giant sign that says checkpoint. That's very handy. Yes, I mean somewhat facetious, but at the same time, it actually is kind of nice. Instead of having to be like, what does that thing do? It's like, it tells you what that thing does. These are bananas. Can I just say that, like, legitimately? There we go. Super monster combo. Makes me feel like I'm playing a fine game, man. Uh, what's this thing say? Good way to throw fruit wall so I can make pressure plates. At least you didn't tell me something I already knew. Sorry, throw fruit, but I have another target for you! Really? You know what? I just don't even care. Because I'm sure it's just points. Peck! 
pantry can also jump up on throw fruit to get to higher places. He may stack throw fruit as well by throwing a fr throw fruit on top of another throw fruit. Why is some throw fruit lowercase and some throw fruit capitalized? No, that's that's kind of my question at this point. Also, another question. Are those tiki boxes terrified when they see me destroy one of their own like that? Or they're just like, eh, I'm, you know, this is my fate. I'm okay with it. Because I would think that'd be kind of horrifying. I like that there are very fixed locations where stuff like this is supposed to go. It makes it easy. Where does... Oh. Uh, I didn't know it was going to be a slide. <laughs> Oops. This game's pretty darn dangerous. Can we uh, agree with that here? Fire and... Oh, that was stupid. <laughs> this one goes boom. Uh, is there anything else in there? I'm gonna do that again and look for holes in the wall. If there's a place I can warm up to. I don't think so, but I don't think so. Nope, I didn't see anything. Hey, it's that one kid. I recognize this kid, but I recognize you, kid. You're a classic. Freezy fruit. Patrick can pick up freezy fruit and throw it. It'll temporarily freeze goo. He can slide on frozen goo until it thaws. Is that the water stuff you fall into? Because if so, that's kind of yeah. If Patrick belly flops near robots, he can damage or stun them. Small robots will simply be defeated by Patrick's belly flop, and larger robots will be stunned. That's not that's not a belly flop. So they must mean this. I don't know if I really call it a belly flop, but I can I can kind of appreciate it. Uh, okay. Oh, that just frees everything. I see you, purple. Yes! The best color ever! Man, that freezy fruit's pretty darn impressive, huh? Ah, oh, there we go. Something even better than a purple. A sock! Majestic. Yes! A completed pair! I feel much better. I like how they hide these little tubes. Just slightly enough to make it worth finding. And on the other hand, it's like, eh, I wouldn't have even done that or missed it. Oh, jeez, he had such a panicked face on his expression on his face. How many of these do I have to carry? A lot more than this, Patrick, I assure you. I don't even know why I bother. Seeing his face like that when something's blowing up really kind of uh, reinforces the whole idea that passion looks delicious. Man, they're putting out a lot of clean underwear for me. Oh, I get it. Gotta destroy those guys. And then I get. Oh. Oh. That's gonna be tricky. I was thinking I was gonna get the throw fruit up there after. Clearing out these jerks. But I actually have to get around them anyway. Wait, that destroys the fruit. Um uh, Huh. Well this is how you have to do it. Interesting. Okay, got another uh stratagem. Try this. Go, go, Patrick. Go, Patrick. No, oh, that's not even close. Ah. Uh, what? Can you just walk it up here? Maybe that's the secret. No, you can't walk it up there, though. Ah, darn it. And then how the heck 
This feels like a real which came first, chicken or the egg problem here. I'm just gonna throw it in the water. Fair. What does this say? Yes, I know that. Wait, what does that say? Oh. Pick up rope as the instrument and throw them in other robots. Nice. How do I stun them? I just kill them. How would I stun the robot? I don't know. Like this? Oh, that actually worked. No! You jerk! There we go. I finally figured that crap out, because I'm stupid. <laughs> That's all you had to do. It was cannonball. And then... You can stun the robot and throw the robot at the switch. Ah, uh, helps you're not stupid. I'm telling you folks, I'm just playing as Patrick. In this game and in life. Ooh, we, I am Parks. I need to rehydrate myself. Mmm, I tell you what, that's good water. And not only that. This isn't the only tall glass of water around here. Yeah, I know you know. I know you know. Oh, yeah.